Hey, my Capricorns. Yes, Capricorns. Christmas is over. You feel what I'm saying? I hope everybody had a great Christmas. Capricorn season is in a fucking building. Okay, we've been in the building. Now we really in the building. Um, My Christmas was great. It was lovely. It was nice. I'm exhausted. Yeah, 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 yeah. I still got my granddaughter. She's been here a week. Um, I'm just tired. I'm not doing anything today. I will be doing a read for the next seven days. That will take us to the, after the New Year's. We're going to see what's going on. I don't know what plans people have. Me, personally, I really don't have too many plans. I was thinking maybe going to the Poconos. But if I don't do that with my kids or something like that, I'll probably be low just waiting for 12 o'clock to be praying to the divine. You, you feel what I'm saying? I'm not really trying to party on New Year's Eve in that nature, unless I'm with a friend or something, like, for a sex way. But other than that, mm -mm, I want to, like, do something for my birthday or something like that, which will be that weekend after the New Year's. But I don't really have any plans. I don't know what's going to come up. I might even decide that I am going somewhere. I don't know. You feel what I'm saying? It depends on what I want to do. Um, Yeah. So... Overall energy, my energy is great. I cleaned up everything. Then I clean up as I go, so I don't have no problem with a lot of stuff. I still didn't open my stuff that I received and other things like that as far as myself. Because I'll wait. I usually like to open my gifts near my birthday. You feel what I'm saying? Because I got shit I don't even remember. I bought myself, then I got gifts. I appreciate everything that I received. I, re I, re I appreciate everything anyway. I don't just say I appreciate shit. I really appreciate shit. It's a difference. That's not the same. Uh, we're going to go ahead. We're going to jump into this reading. I hope everybody have a great week. I know everybody trying to get rest, whatever the case may be. I know everybody, you know, home from school, situations like that. But just move ahead. Figure out what you want to do. I don't do resolutions or what is it? Resolutions for New Year. I don't do that at all. I just, I don't do it. I don't write it. I don't sit and be like, oh, this is what I'm going to do next year. I just go ahead and do it. I'm just bossing. That's how I feel. I don't really put, oh, this is going to do this. Because, like, that's, to me, is like bullshit, Capricorns. Y'all already know people be on bullshit. So, yeah. On the bottom of the deck from the gate, like, was already at the bottom when I turned this over. Was maybe a cancer you could be dealing with. This could be somebody coming towards you, offering you love, but really was sex. Um, Or this could just be, you could be matching this energy. You could be dealing with a water sign. We're going to jump right into your reading. We're going to see what's going on for my Capricorns. This is for the next seven days, cats. For the next seven days. Holy Spirits, what is the energy surrounding my cats for the next seven days? The next seven days. Okay, we have... All right, yeah, you're going to be the yourself. A lot of... That's like Capricorns, the Virgo energy. Some Virgos like to be to their self, you feel me? But this is Virgo energy. This is like basically when you go within, you be the yourself, you meditate, you pray... That's basically what I'm doing when I take my granddaughter home. I'm going to just take some days and just just, just refocus. You feel what I'm saying? So, yeah, that's what I'm seeing a lot of you doing. And somebody can't be trusted, like I said. This was the other way. This person that's coming into you, present energy, you may think it's something else, but they want sex here. They just not to be trusted. So, be careful the next seven days with people coming into your life that you close cycles with. You feel what I'm saying? Because they're not to be trusted. It could be a cancer. It don't have to be. But whatever the situation is, Caps, they're not to be trusted for the next seven days. So let's see what else is coming out for you guys. Holy Spirit, what is the energies? Okay, yeah, I see you definitely coming up out. I have a lot on your plate. A lot of secrets came out. Wow. Yeah, Capricorn. It's a lot of devilish energy here. And you ended something. Or you will be ending something in the next seven days. So, yeah, you're going to be ending something the next seven days, Capricorn. It's going to be an ending here and something of some devilish energy of some kind. But I already showed you who's trying to come in your energy. Could be dealing with Scorpio or another Capricorn. Could be a water sign, a fire sign. Could be a Virgo, but something ending or something's ending. It could be a death of a situation, person, place, or thing. There's going to be some secret somebody keeping from you here as well here. Or you may be keeping something to yourself, Caps. But with that death card, we're going to clarify it. Yeah, you, in the past, you come up out of thinking about money. You come up out of having a for situations. Could be a Leo. 
you happy as fuck energy here, Leo. Energy is a judgment in your favor here. Somebody's not working to a bag here. Somebody is definitely coming up out of a painful ending, a backstab, a betrayal with this death card here. We're going to definitely clarify that. You moving fast away from some type of energy. Could be a cancer here. Don't have to be. Yeah, you're coming up out of confusion, past energy, competition, confusion. I feel like it's confusion. You got new love could be coming towards you. Partnership, relationship, or friendship here. You could be dealing with a water sign. It don't have to be. Yeah, you got the whole world in your hands at this time. You coming up out of not knowing which way to go or feeling like a wounded warrior. You could be dealing with a fire sign. Somebody is stuck in a situation they put themselves in. Somebody's trying to offer you friendship here. But I like I see, I, I don't know about that. I don't think you should really fuck with that. You be dealing with a water sign. They fell under the devil and coming up out of a backstab and betrayal with this energy here. You already dealt with that. You don't want nothing to do with that energy, wherever it's coming from. I'm going to clarify this devil and his death part. Yeah, you building your name, your fame, you building your pinnacles up here. You could have outside influences, famous people could be helping you. You could be dealing with a Taurus you got to cut off here. Or you may hear about a death of a Taurus. Let's see what's the energy here. Yeah, this is somebody flighty here that's in and out of your life. They always in and out of your life here. You be dealing with a Sagittarius. Yeah, somebody's definitely coming towards you, offering you some love, some support here, some friendship. It could be a new partnership here. They offering you something light here. You could be dealing with a fire sign. This is somebody money that's not right at this time as well. So you got to be careful that they're not trying to offer you something to take something from you. It fell with the page. This person may act like they the king of pentacles, but they a page. You feel what I'm saying? And the King of Pentacles is a Capricorn as well. Yeah, somebody got a bunch of bullshit with them. That's what I'm saying. You could be dealing with a water sign. This person that's coming in your life. Yeah, you're going to have your guard up. You're going like, to be like, get the fuck out of here. Like, fuck out of here. You're going to be standing up, standing your ground here. Whatever this is the next seven days, you're coming up out of putting yourself in situations here. With the Page of Swords here, this is somebody that been watching you here. Or you could be watching somebody. This could be an air sign, Capricorn. Yeah, this is somebody you left in the past, in the past already air sign energy i don't see you dealing with this shit again yeah you come up out of anxiety here with this situation here somebody's stressing about losing you here or this could be a loss of a person in the next seven days somebody could be keeping something secret here or maybe about a death here take what resonate here yeah, somebody's unbalanced, and it's a top. Wow, it's a tower moment coming in the next seven days here. You could be dealing with somebody that's a snake. Somebody got away with something without you knowing. That's what I'm saying. Somebody's hiding something from you here. You may find out in the next seven days. It may break a tower moment in your life. Somebody that's unbalanced here. You could be dealing with a Sagittarius. Somebody got away with something here. If they didn't, they are going to try to get away something with something Capricorn. I don't like that energy with this death and devil and all this. The next seven days. Yeah, you will be celebrating. This is somebody that got a lot of debt. They got money problems. You may hear about somebody with money problems or they're coming to you. You could be dealing with an earth sign here. Holy Spirit, what is the energy surrounding my boss as Capricorns at this time? What is the energy surrounding my boss as Capricorns? Yeah, with the Ace of Swords, this is somebody you cut off, you got truth about. They're unhappy in their life, and they see you at the Queen of Swords as a throne. Like, you speaking that truth, and you cut them off here. Air sign energy, Capricorn. Capricorn building my grandbaby twisting, but it don't matter because we're going to bed so super early tonight. It's going to be crazy. What is the energy surrounding my Capricorns? Yeah, with the hangman, somebody stuck in the situation they put their self in here. Yeah, because the Queen of Pentacles here, Capricorn, you may be getting some messages about something in the next seven days. It's coming towards you fast about your past. This is somebody coming back from your past, but they have nothing to offer you. You could be dealing with a water sign. Yeah, it's falling on a future and a death card here. Yeah, this is somebody that manipulated you. This is gaslighted you in the past already, Capricorn. Next seven days. Holy Spirit, what is the energy? Yeah. You're not using your intuition. You want to take a chance about a chance in something. And you're not going to close these cycles that need to be closed. You're definitely going to come up out of overthinking something. And it's like somebody coming through fast. This could be you or somebody else with the truth cutting somebody off. I hope it's you, Cappy. We're going to see what's going on because there's a lot of stuff going on in this week. Holy Spirit, what is the energy surrounding my Capricorns the next seven days? Yeah, you will be celebrating here the next seven days. 
Capricorn season. You're going to have a justice in your favor. Somebody's ships ain't coming in, but somebody definitely got an ace of pentacles. You could be getting gifts of money in the next seven days. With the lovers here, you coming up out of making a decision. It could be about a Gemini. You moving fast away from this decision. Somebody trying to have you make a decision. And you like, I'm getting the fuck out of here. I'm not dealing with that. This is my birthday season. Yeah, because the nine of pentacles, you, you eating the fruits of your labor. You stacking your money. You don't got time for that Capricorn in the building. Yeah, this is somebody that's not to be trusted here. They see you make yourself unhappy. You could be dealing with a cancer. Yeah, this person's just trying to leave you out on the cold here, Capricorn. Yeah, good luck is on your side. You come up, I don't have a patience for this person here. We're going to have to clarify the devil, the death, and the five of pentacles. This could be somebody leaving you out of sick or somebody leaving you in poverty as well. Yeah, you a boss. That's what they see you as. You got no love for them. You could be dealing with the Aries. You don't got no love for them. You like, get the fuck out of here. Yeah, you got other options. Some good news is coming to you. You coming up out of a trail here. Third party interferences here. Yeah, you turning your back on something that no longer serve you. Bottom line, energy. With the Knight of Pentacles, somebody money is literally coming in slow. That's why they're coming to you. There's no new beginning with this person. This person is plotting, but they can't defeat you. They're trying to steal your energy or steal from you. Aquarius energy. Yeah. Somebody's coming up out of having peace in their life. You're going to cut somebody off. You could be dealing with a, a fire sign and an air sign. King and queen. Somebody making something happen. This could be you embodying something, speaking the truth and making something happen. Or this could be somebody in your energy making something happen. Yeah, a lot of secrets coming out here with the moon reverse. You be dealing with a Scorpio the next seven days. Some secrets here. They're going to start coming out. Or your secrets could be coming out. Or somebody else is keeping secrets from you. You're going to find out. Yeah, your emotions in fact, You're going to be happy the next seven days. Yeah, you victorious and happy the next seven days, Capricorn. This week could be somebody in your energy or something. We want to say, yeah, you give and take equally. Somebody could be giving you some money the next seven days. Yeah, somebody ain't got no love for somebody. Somebody don't love you, the divine or their self. Their cup is empty and the divine going to show you this. So you may want to avoid certain people the next seven days. You don't want to hear that shit. We want to see what's up with this devil here. That's coming with the um, near future. This could be you, Capricorn, because this is your read. But we want to make sure because with the devil, something's in and permanently in the next seven days. Holy Spirit, what's the energy? Yeah, something's happening really slow the next seven days in your life. Let's see, Capricorn. Yeah, somebody's not going to be able to build something they're trying to build here. Yeah, somebody's going to try to snake you the next seven days. You may have to deal with legal with somebody the next seven days. Hater energy. Let's see what's the death card. Yeah, somebody not leaving the past and behind. Somebody living in lies. Somebody coming up out of a celebrating with maybe three people or a third party situation. Yeah, somebody's watching you here. This could indicate trouble with the police. Yeah, somebody just want to rest or be at peace or somebody may be resting in peace the next seven days. Somebody's going to be staying balanced over this situation. Yeah, somebody's not going to be able to work at this time. So for this reading, it could go either way the next seven days here. Let's see why the five of pentacles, the lack of wealth. Holy Spirit, what is the energy surrounding the five of pentacles? Yeah, you're giving your emotion elsewhere. So I feel like you're leaving somebody out in the cold. Yeah, it's somebody not making something happen in your energy. And you come up out of have a stress for a situation. You come up out of overthinking the situation about somebody. I'm seeing somebody trying to be in your energy here for the next seven days. But they want some other shit here. Like, you may even hear about a death the next seven days, Capricorn. You may be coming up out of dealing with a third party the next seven days, but you definitely leaving people out in the cold. You're not dealing with no bullshit. You ending all bullshit here. For some, this is ending all bullshit before the new year hit. For others, you already ended shit and motherfuckers just trying to come back in your energy here, but you're going to end it again and you're going to leave them out in the cold and the devil could represent that. And you bringing a towel moment on people asses. Like, listen, I'm really not fucking with you. This is what it is. For others... This could be a towel moment hitting your ass in the next seven days. Somebody could be leaving you out in sickness, poverty, or you may hear about a death here. It could be a um, a, um eternal illness of some sort. Could be a Sagittarius, could be a Scorpio here you may hear about. Let's see what the oracle come out for my Capricorns so I can shut this down. 
Holy Spirit, what is the energy surrounding my ball says? Most hated Capricorns. Happy birthday to my Capricorns. Wow, I see two-faced energy. I don't even deal with that at all. And a new you for 2023. I like that. I like that. Let's see what else going to come out once I do the shuffle. I like that. Sorry, that just went. Holy Spirit, what is the energy surrounding my Capricorns for the next seven days? What's the energy for my Capricorns the next seven days? What's the energy surrounding Death Car? Oh my God. Capricorn. I know y'all like, what the fuck? Listen. Oh, and these came out. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. All right, here we go. We got two death cards. Two death cards. The Five of Pentacles. The Tower. And the Devil. Now, Capricorn. With this read here, I keep it real. A lot of my Capricorns, it could even be myself. You're going to hear of a death. The next seven days, you're going to hear of a death. I am so sorry to have to tell you this. You may already heard this. But this is going to be a death of some sort you're going to hear about here it could be somebody got sick here somebody may was keeping the secret about being sick here and it's going to bring a tower moment in your life capricorn that's why the devil was here it's going to fuck you up this is for some of you for some of you this is a something that's ending 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 there's no going back even if it was a way to go back is no going back this could be a person, place, or thing. Something is about to be fucked up here. And I got to keep it real because I can't say, oh, this is going to be an end of the relationship. Not with two death cards in the same read back to back like that. Then the, the, the card of lack of poverty. Um, excuse me, lack of wealth. Being left out in the cold. A sickness. A towel moment with the devil card here. Yeah, this definitely could be a death of someone. Um, It definitely is. If this is not a death of someone, you may hear of a death of somebody or something's just ending. It's just going to be something that's just, it can't, it can't go back. You know how some like, oh, it could be an ending of a relationship, a friendship, a partnership. Not with these cards here. You got a lot of major coroners here. This is just not normal. And I'm just so sorry. And like, if somebody is dealing with something like this. Or you know somebody that may be on their deathbed. But what I'm feeling here is this This is sudden. This is somebody that this is sudden, but they may kept it from you. And it's going to just shock the world. This is going to be something that hurt. This is going to hurt. It's going to hurt. I can't like sugarcoat it. It's going to hurt. And at bottom of the deck, unhappy energy. So it's like you coming up out of happy energy. You feel what I'm saying? The next seven days, like, listen, just be on your shit. You feel me? It's just a lot, you know? I felt this through my bones. Could be even for me. Like, who knows? So I love you, Capricorns. Happy fucking birthday. You feel what I'm saying? Do your thing. Have fun. Live life. Don't fuck with these snakes. Let them be what they be. Leave them in the pit, in the trash, because that's what they are. They trash cappies. Peace. Whoa! Everybody gets this out the way. These is all my gifts for myself. And gifts others gave to me. I didn't get to open them. So, I'll get to it when I want to do it. Hey, Capricorn fucking season.